still beautiful. It's a piece of art. So go go support that in the workshop, and they get more Bisons in the game. Absolutely. Okay, we're into the pistol now. We do have LGB versus Titan. LGB, luckily enough for them, winning that knife round, which we didn't commentate, so we didn't actually know that until now, they have started on the favorable t CT side. Indeed. Uh, the uh, the advantage, as it were. Oh, uh, that's actually good work by Kenny S already. And uh, his opposite number has seven health already. That's not a good start to the round. He's not backed away here as well. Look at this. Just sat there. He's afraid. He's, and he's not afraid at all. He's showing... Those monster testicles right now. He would have obviously run away. Everyone else would have run away. Kenny S believes he would have run away, but he's now going to tr try and get around the box. Look, did he, did he check? Yes, he did. Luckily. They, they are huge testicles. Why would you stay by the box? Couldn't even move. They're so huge. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Tyson. <laughs> Don't like you weren't thinking it. Oh, so. my goodness. Titan able to. <laughs> oh my goodness. Able to get the upper hand. Indeed. Towards the A bomb side now. Quickly, Dan. I'm doing it. You're making it work. Uh, uh, no, no, no. It's all good. Yeah, uh, it looks like bag. a main hit here. They've got one in toxic, three in main. Uh, four in main. Make that as well. A great couple of shots from Rubinio. First off, though, uh, Maniac and Kenny S getting them back. Sorry, actually, it was Apex got the kill. Maniac with a double. And the last man is dispatched into CT Heaven by Maniac as well. And. Uh, that's a, a very easy first round for Titan, I have to say. Absolutely. Did they lose a man? Um, one, maybe? Yes, they lost only one man. Yeah, one man. So that's, that's that's, that means only one potential scout by, but they're not even going to get the scout there on the LGB side. Let's well, see if they're going to go for any shenanigans, shenanigans here, because there's lots of options to play around like this that you can stack. And if, if, actually, you know, they're going to go for a stack towards the B side, not all on the side, but they have fast, super fast response oh here. Oh, my goodness. This could go well for LGB. Uh, well, we've got the first one. Uh, gets the second one. I'd say that was a plus win. They do get a second one from Vent. And it's just slowed them up a little bit. RPK taking a, a little bit of nade. Uh, actually, someone else taking the nade damage in there as well. I think that was RPK throwing it in. So, 4v3, and the, well, I was going to say equalise, but no, actually, LGB have an advantage here, but RPK's now going to have to do this on his own. 1v2, 1v3 it was originally, it's now 1v1. And what a mess from Titan. This is, uh, this is exactly what's gone wrong for them in the last few weeks, when they've been losing so badly. It's because of exactly these kind of rounds. Should be winning them straightforwardly. Not a clean execution into the bomb site. Now, fake plant, and RPK will win the round. So they've recovered, thanks to a 1v3. Yeah, I mean, you, ha you, have, to, you have to give uh, Tyne a little bit of the benefit of the doubt as well, because... No. They d no. <laughs> nope. No. Nope. Sorry, right, shut All right. down. Because, um, realistically, LGB going with a bit of a gamble there. They could have stacked towards A, they could have stacked towards B, they could have stacked towards middle, but they did choose to go for B, and that was essentially the best possible setup for them there. They took a risk. And Titan, they, they kind of walked into it and got committed into it. So that was really the issue for them. So LGB playing it well, yep. execution early. And now, as we can see, Titan going to be low on the money here. So LGB... Really That's such a mix, really isn't it? Well. I mean, when you get to round three and you're two up and you've got to buy, you know, a couple of tech noise, no main gut, you're like, why? Where, how the hell are we here? We should be, we should be ready to almost fall by. We exactly. should at least have SMGs. I mean, like, what the hell? Like, d guys, we're going to have to eco that third round, even though we won the first two. It's, it's absurd. It's horrible. Uh, but that's what you get if you're going to lose too many men. Great first round. Sloppy second one. Rescued by RPK. Third one, well, looks a bit better here. And RPK's the man going huge yet again. Three from him. Four. Yeah, that's Four from that's RPK. Really, really Just cleans nice. up. Especially considering they lost almost everybody in the previous rounds. So... You know, things definitely looking a little bit better on the money side of things. But, of course, LGB, they're going to be able to force out an eco if they are actually able to take this round. So we're going to have to see the setup from them because they don't have an AWP. Kenny S is on the orb. He is a master of getting the picks early round. And you can see many, many situations where Kenny S is looking for those. And there it is. He will pick up Jake and straight away. So now it's up to existence to tell his team. Okay, guys, we're going to capitalize in this way. This is the push we want to make. And... RGB still have a good hold of middle and B, so can Kenny S get more here? That's the question. The answer is he certainly can't. Oh, and this, by the way, is a very typical move. Kenny S, that smoke is perfectly placed. He's got a set, yeah, set way to do edge. that. He jumps up on the locker, and this is a one-way situation. You'll see just a vague outline if there is someone at the quad area, yeah. and if they are, 
then they're pretty dead. Yeah, I've had this done to me a couple of times defending CT side exactly in that Ooh. position. Beautiful. And uh, just to make it, you know, even more special, that was a headshot as well. Uh, Polly's going to pick up one. No. Well, even in a really good position and really with the first shot into that toxic area, that should have been a kill from Polly. Instead, uh, it's now a 5v2. And uh, LGB are, uh, well, they're kind of screwed. Yeah, just got to go for the hunt now and oh. get rid of those weapons. Hello. Oh, dear. Oh, this Maniac! Oh! Uh, well flashed in the end, we'll of course. We'll pretend we didn't see that. Yeah. Uh, right. Someone edit that out of the VOD immediately. <laughs> uh, it's all, all good, though. Uh, Titan just losing their one man. And uh, the 1v4. They might get another one here. Rubinio. Oh, that's, that's awkward. That's super awkward. Oh, head uh, in the paint right there. Yeah, a couple, that. couple from Kevin as well. 4-0 uh, uh, for the rubbish Titan. Definitely. So, yeah. uh, well, so the thing but is... You know what I'm saying, because I said at the start they were rubbish at the moment. And they, they have been playing rubbish, there's no doubt about it. I mean, you know, it's all relative, of course. So I want to qualify this, because there'll be some Titan fanboys who go, I hate Red Eye, he's always shitting on Titan, telling how bad it out. No, no. Let me, let me <laughs> just put this to rights, okay? It's all relative. In the relative terms of the top 10 or 16 teams in the world, they are still there. Have they been playing badly in comparison to those? Yes, they have. Yeah, I think that's very fair to say. And so hence my rubbish comment. Yeah. Because yeah. when they're playing rubbish, they're still a top 10 side in the world. But that's, you know. They're definitely a, a bit too inconsistent at yeah. the moment. That's, that, is, that is very evident. Stop being nice. I'm, I'm a nice guy, <laughs> Paul. <laughs> nice okay. DDK. Nice DDK. <laughs> this is why I get trolled. <laughs> because I'm a nice guy. <laughs> that's why I get trolled all the time. Okay, so um, the, the basically the, the only way that they managed to, to basically beat that buy round of LGB was just Kenny. Yes, he got he got yeah. not only no, pick on B side, also A side. Yeah. That's pretty much it for the Titan to be able to lose from there. It takes something remarkable. From Got to tell you as well, RPK on fire right now, carrying nine of the frags so far in the four rounds. RPK serious. Nine. He didn't just come out of retirement for nothing, Red Eye. He came out of retirement. He could drop retired. some bombs. Not really. You can't retire a hobby. No. That's what Zero Four said. Yeah. No, that's it. John Hill, what a legend. Wow. So uh, that's that's uh, that's quite a statement actually by Screams, saying that RPK could be the best player in the world. He's uh, definitely a very strong aimer. Was was a fantastic aimer back in the day as well. Yeah. Was always a really good aim. And and they, that's something Titan definitely needs. But we'll have to see how this Byron goes now for LGB because now they're going to be pulling out the AWP. They've got way more grenades. This is going to look like a much better setup uh, on the defense. And they've taken that very mid-heavy uh, approach at the start with a quick possible boost into the vents if they need it. And uh, just one on the A site who is spotting at Seves with that jump by the red container. So he will be able to see anybody who is moving into A main and looking for the picks. And so far it's no one, and LGB just have to bide their time at the moment and uh, see if they can get anything done. But with the setup they have, they can't play for information here. They yeah. are completely reactive, and Kenny is looking for the whack-a-mole again. And uh, we know how devastating that can be. Yeah, I've heard he's a bit good. He is quite good. I like this boost, by the way. Yeah, it's, uh, it's Play that on a public and everyone's like, hacker, oh my god. Instant. So, 50 seconds. Gonna Ooh. start thinking about moving towards a bomb site any moment now of Titan. And, uh, well, <laughs> Toxic Door shot again. <laughs> and then it reopened, just teasing them. Polly knows they're in there. So it's going to be really tough now. They've, they've not really got a split going. It's just no. a squeaky door and A main uh, trying to get through. It, this is actually really messy, you're right. And, uh, well, they're just going to have to gung ho into the site right now with time ticking down. 25 seconds, Manny. It's going to try and push him towards the A bomb site from the side and does get the first one with some nice little tap, tap, taps. And the second one goes down. Yes, Kenny S gets another one now. Advantage, Titan into the bomb site. 14 seconds to go. Bomb about to be planted. Is it or is it already? No, there we go. Okay. Had me confused for a second. It was on the spot, wasn't moving. Uh, beautiful couple of shots from Rain. Then he's going to have to reload quickly. Kenny S down. 1v3 is a 1v2 now. They're quite low as well. Very low. Uh, well, at least half house, both of them. Chance here then. Oh, well. When you've got your back to him, he's even more deadly than usual. And that was that was kind of a sad round for LGB there because that they was had really the sad, wasn't it? yeah they had the early round advantage they they essentially had a good setup to deal with the push but they just mm. they got out aimed that that's as simple as as it was they got out aimed on the entries Apex coming in and to be RPK. fair 
that's what was going to happen if they were going to leave it that late and not have a strategy of any kind, because there wasn't really any strategy there. Uh, they d I think they definitely are going to need to try to mix things up with some aggression yeah. later into the round, try to it's take six zero down. It's six zero. Yep. I mean, like uh, any time LGB want to join the game and you know maybe connect to the server <laughs> and maybe take part in a few frags. And no couple frags. of you. Yep. Oh my god. Taking in service with nothing at the moment. But yeah, I mean, it's it's quite disappointing from them at the moment. There's so many ways that they can mix things up. Dan, Again, you're too nice. I'm I sorry, I, buddy, I, I but you are too nice. Qu it, not quite good enough. I want to. I want to expect. I, mm. I'd like to expect some aggressive plays coming in from them. Some map control yeah. plays here. For example, pop flashing into a main. Some moves like this. They're playing really reactively. And Titan. That's. They love that. They they're gonna just sit there. Yeah. Gonna push you back. Yeah. So they take the angels that they want to take. Oh and goodness. then you're playing Titan's game. Do you want to play Titan's game, Paul? No, no, you don't. No, because it, it, otherwise it ends up being seven zero. Uh, oh look, what do you know? Seven zero. <laughs> So, really sick money here from Titan, because not only, and this is the thing, right, this is the key difference, not only are Titan winning these rounds, but you can see a scoreline like this, and you can see Titan having um, like very low money, like around 5k or something, but no, they, ha they have ridiculous money, because LGB are not getting in any damage. Their defenses are just failing all over the map at the moment, so they need a, a systematic change of how, how they actually play this. A systemic, systemic is, as well as a call there, change. And uh, they are going with more or less the same setup here. And uh, we have seen weakness from them in the past on this map. It is why teams are picking it against them. And uh, Zevis alone there by the quad box behind the squeaky door. Just again, playing reactively against Titan at the moment, waiting for them to make a move as they slowly clear angle upon angle. Which is fine, and the setup's not terrible, but uh, like you say, it's just aim v aim. Oh, this might be a bit nicer though. Uh, they've managed to get one Must in boost. mid. Uh, and they've got existence in there. Polly with a lovely shot into Toxic picks off RPK. So that's two out of two. This is much better. Uh, but then, well, it's all gone a little bit wrong again. Uh, as uh, Apex gets what is effectively a free kill. But reply back from Rubinio. He's downed by Titans. Kenny S. Orp. Yet again. Can he dig them out of a hole once more? Oh, well. <laughs> that's perfectly baited. Really perfect. If you're going to go in there, have some cover to follow it up. Jake came in from the back, though. And we're now 1v2. And it's not going to happen this time round for Titan. Nicely done. Good rotation by LGB as well. Oh, dear. Okay, so we do have a keyboard problem. We've got a key here. I have, a, I have it, yeah. No, it's, it's mine. Look. It's mine. GG. No, it's not GG yet. Can't press the button, mate. It's my key. Yeah, can't do it. All right. Uh, yeah, keyboard problem. So okay. uh, I've got to pause. So, so that round essentially. The thing that's that's really strange here is that if you look at Titan, um, Titan are not necessarily playing. Okay, well, okay. First of all, as <laughs> as we're showing well, the well, knife, I was going to say, why don't you talk about the knife that's all on right. the screen? All right. I know you guys fancy a huntsman knife, nah. blue steel. Look at it. Nah. Look at it. Nah. Are you looking at it, Paul? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Sorry, look yeah. how blue it is. Wow. Look, look, how, look how blue. That's lovely. That's a manly knife. And it's just a man's knife, isn't it? You see that on the lumberjack. You can, you can cut chips up and fish like that, no problem at all. You chips having, and fish. You can have be having chish and fips in no time at all. Oh my God, Paul. Anyway, so when we hit the 450k followers, we will we'll be giving away uh, this knife, and we'll be giving away an Asimov orb. So that's really? that's can the I next have, stretch. Can I have the no, you can't. Why? Because. Because. But, but I only have two ops at the moment. You only have two. What else do you have? Uh, I have a red line and a Cordacera stat trap. Oh, fair enough. Yeah, fair that's enough. That's quite nice. Um, but I would like an Asimov, Dan. You, you Dan. You're only going to get Bison. Dan. You're going to get this Bison. Dan. Would you be happy with that? I think yeah, I, of course. I no, but I already have a Bison and it's Love from Velocity Girl on it. From what? Because she you know, gave it to me. It says Love oh, really? from Velocity Girl on it. Nice. Actually, like the name of the gun is, she, is Love she from Velocity Girl. Is she making a move there? She might be. Making I don't know. I wouldn't notice it. Did you try sending a skin back? Wait, what? Did I give a skin back? Yeah, it's a, because oh, a it's a reciprocate. Right, yes. yeah, yeah. Um, uh, I did actually, I gave her a deagle. You gave her a deagle? Yeah, a one deagle. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I'm pretty sure we're still talking about Counter-Strike, so I'm going to yeah. move on. What are you talking about? <laughs> All right. Oh, Dan! Dan! Hey. Hey, I'm innocent. Time no. out, Dan. Go and sit in the corner. Oh, my goodness. I'm kind Dan. of. I wish I was Dan. able to sit in a corner away from you. Dan. 
Uh, anyway, uh, Titan ploughing through LGB yeah. right now. 7-1. I mean, so that, that last round LGB actually took there was, was again, Titan playing their round. They, they, yeah. The thing is, Titan are not taking middle with any set plays. Nope. They're not taking B storage or AMA with any set plays. They're, they're basically creeping in all these angles. This was the first time we saw LGB out being kind of able to out-position them or surprise them yeah. with their positioning. And that's basically the game that's been played right yeah. now. It's almost like Existence is saying, you know what, guys? Uh, he let's just send uh, three to A, two to B, and see who gets a pick, and then we'll go to that side. Yeah, he wants, and he especially wants Kenny S to move out there yeah. and give his team an advantage for him to then make a call upon. And RPK has been in Toxic pretty much since round one, I think. And uh, so, so essentially, what, what, they, what needs to happen here from LGB is they do need to switch up the way they're playing against the style of Titan, because yeah. by being so reactive it's, and, and not pushing the angles, because, because it, they could easily, like, look at this, if they pl uh, flashed into a main right now, they could, two ver they, they could get two versus once. Yeah. And that, because the spread of Titan is all over the map here, because they're looking for opportunities all over the map. And so LGB could apply a, a more potent strategy to counter this. Looks but like we are going to make a move in towards this bomb site once more. A uh, little bit of action going on in the mid area this time round as well. So it might just be slowed down by that smoke. We've got a boost up in mid as well as they pop out. The two go uh, through. Uh, Jacob's going to get the first one, won't get the second though. Good cover from Existence. He's then down by Robinho, who again was just sitting to the left-hand side of Garage. Why would you not check there? Uh, very odd. That's two rounds he's done that in the last three. But RPK somehow got out of Toxic, got himself onto site without see it being seen, has got himself two kills in there as well. And Kenny S cleans up. And Titan have an 8-1 lead on Cash. Beautiful. Yeah, that's... Uh... RPK with 14, by the way, already. 14! So I, I want to I want to express my my LGB fanboyism only right. extends to Dust Two and Mirage because they, okay. they play those maps not, like gods. Not surprising. Not yeah, surprising. I, I, because I they've been utterly horrible yeah, on this no, map so far. I, I agree. I agree. But if I'm going to make a video, right, and, I'm, right. and I'm going to explain, is it going to be called LGB a rubbish at cash? No, it's going to oh. be LGB a beast. Uh, oh, the beast of okay. Dust Two. Right. It should be called Dan is a fraud fan <laughs> of LGB. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I, I, I agree with the production who just said that. Uh, well, they said something else. No. Oh, poor DDK. I get abused. <laughs> <laughs> you, you, you actually just got ruined by production in the, your ear. Uh, the, voice of God, the voice of God. Yeah, I would probably take your ears out because As I like to call you'll it. never recover from that. Anyway, Polly on site right now. 1v4 uh, with USP in hand. No problem at all. Polly's got this. Absolutely and utterly got this in every way, shape and form. Except for RPK in front of him. Indeed. He, he decided to jump at the very moment that he got peaked, which is never good. But... LGB, again, this is the problem, is that their money got reset, yeah. and they're screwed. And to and be honest, look at Titan's money as well. They're struggling. I mean, RPK's only got 15,050. He that's needs not a really drop very much. He does right now. I always ask for a drop when yeah. I lose money to troll people. <laughs> I think it's really funny. I do it the way around. They, dro they, they drop for you, and then they realize that they're broke. They're just they're no, no, no. going you bust to drop dude, for you, you and you're around. rich. You wait until you've got loads of money. Someone asks for a drop, and you drop them a USP. <laughs> drop a USP. <laughs> just, and then just leave them in the dust. Just <laughs> looking at the USP and CT spawns, <laughs> looking at it. <laughs> Uh, oh, great start from Polly. Double. That's what we want to see. Yeah, that's much better from LGB. We need those aggressive pushes. Now, if they could only try to flash in and take this position aggressively, especially if they have the bomb there. However, they are backing away, and we do have Kenny S coming in. He does get the shot into Zeves through the squeaky door, and this is going to start to give opportunities here now for yeah. Titan. Uh, smoke's being laid down. They're going to double cover this one. Flash is in, and, uh, well, they haven't made a move just yet. They're going to wait for RPK. And the firebombs are unleashed as well. Good cover onto the side here. Maynick now pushing towards Quad. Does get that shot in on Polly. He was the nuisance of that A bomb site because he'd already got two. And Kenny S now searching as well as the rotation has already begun. 2v2 though. Rubinho has picked up the kill on existence. Now, can they take this site back? They haven't taken anything back so far, but this one's going very well. Jacob Skinner get the first on Kenny S. Maniac, last man alive. 1v2. Gets surprised from round the back and LGB. Not only to win themselves the round, but actually have taken a yep. bomb site back for the first time in eleven rounds. Yeah, this is really nice, and again, it, it does. It stemmed from exactly what we're talking about, where they're able to aggressively take a main because Titan are not investing a lot of players in there. They can get they can get numbers advantage. They yep. can get the tactical advantage with the use of the grenades, and on top of that. Um, I would like to, uh, one way to think about A main on this map is it's almost a little bit like Banana on Inferno, just a little bit, insofar as it's quite easy as a CTs with the right nades to actually take it. Yes. And once you get a deep smoke, you, you, so you, you shut down so much map control from the T's and it, you, can, you can actually do it with one guy. Yeah. 
Um, you can leave one guy there to. It's to still have very a wide open, though. I like the fact that it's so wide open. It gives the terrorists an opportunity, but it also gives CT an opportunity as well. Exactly. So you know these map control plays definitely yeah. are important, especially against the top teams who have really good aimers who are looking for picks like that. They've actually moved players around a little bit, LG, LG because they had Polly out here in quad before. Uh, Zen has now moved back to that role. Where's Polly gone? I think they've got a boost going over the top as well into middle. And uh, yeah. if I'm not Rain, mistaken, or is nope. well, no? Yes, yes, indeed, they did. Straight and Rubenia, look, Rubenia, all the way around the back here. It's going to get Ooh. one, two in the back. No problem at all. They really haven't watched for those rotations at all. Rubinio's done that a number of times now, and he's yeah. getting better and better at it in terms of the timing, but somehow he's got round the back without existence even seeing him. So, so a really good way for existence to be able to shut something down like this, um, because now LGB are starting to adapt, essentially. It's yeah. a little bit, it's a little bit late in yeah, some senses, uh, but, very late. but they are showing an adaptive response, where they're getting the aggressions in, they're abusing the spread of the T's who are looking for the picking strategy. So now existence could say, okay, let's mix in, let's just go for, like a, let's go for either like a set play, like just take, take middle quickly because they won't have the numbers on middle yeah. to hit their aggressive timings on A or B. Just to interrupt you quickly, they've spotted him. They know where he is. He popped up on the mini map for them. So they'll know now exactly where he is. That's why they've started to surround him. Look at the mini map right now. All three players around him, around the bomb as well. And they know exactly where he is, exactly where the bomb is. And Jacob coming around behind. He's just going to check because they don't know exactly where he is in terms of location right now, but they'll know roughly where he is between B and CT side. Oh, 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 oh my goodness. That's all right. Zero they're rich. cash? No, they're, they're rich. They're rich. Yeah, it was zero cash though, and it does clean Kenny S out completely and existence out. So, got to be a little bit careful because. The way I Did look no at one this, drop they existence? Lose, okay, no, thanks. If they <laughs> lose this round, then possible eco. Right. Probable eco. Possible partial. So uh, but not really a worry, being that they're 9-3 up on the T-side on cash right oh, now. There you go. And Kenny S is absolutely smashing Polly all over the server. It's a nice, another nice way to, to adapt against that. Because uh, the other thing well, is well... Well, there's a nice way of adapting to that. Don't walk in the way of a bloody orb. That's the way you <laughs> adapt to that. Well, there's, there's, this kind of, uh, there's this one consideration that if they go for the pop flash, the pop flash will actually be so far in front of where Kenny S actually is that he won't really get blinded properly, so he will always be able to make that shot. So it's, it's a good way to counter fast aggression like that. Because if the CTs do that and the Ts are pushing A main a bit like bit further up, then they're screwed. They're all gonna die probably. But uh, that's a good way, good way to approach that. So I like that. That's a, already an adaptive response mm. back there now for Titan. Yep. So they're getting the early run advantage, which they were getting all the time. Yep. Uh, four men outside. Toxic and A right now. Uh, Zeves believes the attack is gonna come from the mid. He would be wrong. It's a uh, defensive counter flash for what he expected to come towards him on a timing, but it hasn't just yet. 30 seconds remaining now. Here comes the push any moment now. They're going to go on 30 here, and Zevez knows it. Firebomb down towards quad side. RPK still sitting in side toxic. They're now trying to push him over the top. He does get one in the middle of that, but Bomb is now going to be planted any second now. Right on cue. And we've got a 3v2. Advantage to the... Belgian Franco team of Titan. The smokes though, everywhere. Yeah, everywhere. Trying to keep them away as far as possible, as quickly as possible. And it's working nicely here because Apex has got himself the kill on Jacob, which has forced Rain away. And uh, well, Rain, Rain, go away. Come back another day. <laughs> you didn't. I did. You, you just did that. I did. You're that guy. You're I that did. guy. I I've, I've, heard, I've heard about you. I went there. <laughs> Shoot me. Uh, yeah, we've also got some Swiss in the mix as well, of course. All right. As well as Belgians and Frenchmen. French, and, Belgian, and, Swiss. And Englishmen and Japanese. I don't know. There's probably all sorts of international players playing that we just don't know about. In there are team. Koreans now. I heard yeah, probably the Koreans, Koreans playing have, in, in Titan. Have, have stepped I think onto existence the... is actually Korean. Do you think so? No. That would be an amazing... <laughs> that would be amazing. I, I was actually once asked a really funny question in StarCraft. Uh, which was, which do you think would be a great five-man Counter-Strike team? Koreans. Yeah, of <laughs> Koreans, StarCraft players. And I was like, well, Flash and Flash. Jadon to start with. Boxer. Right. Oh, look at this, actually. Back into the round, we do have a quick push onto the, the bomb site. And this is, again, another mix-up here from Titan. It is a massive mix-up. They haven't gone, uh, I think, B once, maybe, in pistols, uh, round two. Other than that, I can't remember them actually trying a, a yeah. B push, and it's about time. Uh, Zevez, though, from up high, does get the first kill onto RBK, and that's two of them down, actually. He's going to get a third. No! Oh, my goodness. Uh, Existence somehow managed to pick that one up. 
And bomb planted finally. So pressure switching back round to LGB. They really need this one. They don't want to go in a half at 11 or 12-3 down because then lose the pistols and it's pretty much game over. But that's exactly what they're facing right now. 11-3 to Titan. This is, this is a beasting. It, it's, it's a ploughing. They are... It's a, it's a demolishment. Yeah. It's, I, I, it's I, super califragilistic espialidocious. That's what it is. Do you, you have ad many adjectives, so... <laughs> Years of practice. I, I don't even see a thesaurus <laughs> on hand here. He, this guy's going for th hold thesaurus. On, uh, thesaurus .com. Okay. Brilliant. Well, again, uh, Kenyus gets a like, pick. How many times do you have to get killed there before you stop going there? Yeah, it's it's uh, Kenny S with an AWP, and you're going to face him with what? Crouching? <laughs> with hopes and dreams. <laughs> Belief. Crushed. Well, I, I don't know. I just... I. It just seems daft. I mean, you're going to keep doing the same thing. Isn't that the definition of madness? Doing the same thing over and over and expecting a different result. Yeah, I think they're just they're a little bit hopeless, looking for some of these, just something basically. Hopeless but they, they right. keep exploiting it. Mm. So Kenneth is always going to be there, and they don't seem to get the message hi, at the moment. Hi, B-bomb site. And with those pistols, they are able to actually get some guns on themselves, as LGB are actually holding the site still, but the smokes are down. Oh, and oh, oh. Reuben mm. out. Got the first one. I thought he was going to get the second one there because it was CZ, so he had to reload. Uh, but they are picking up frag after frag after frag here. Only Kenny S alive. They do pick up their fourth round of the half. A little bit sloppy from Titan towards the end of that, uh, that half. But I'm being picky, frankly, because the rubbish Titan are 11 4 up on the T side of cash. Yep. And that was a very, very good half indeed. I think I think this was a really, really quite clear, quite clear of a story a of, of, yeah, of essentially just how strategy. The strategy of Titans' offense, LGB were not able to adapt qu yep. uh, quickly enough. Yep. And they weren't able to actually identify it quickly yep. enough to understand how to adapt to it. And then when they, adapt, they did start to adapt, I don't think they really quite understood how then Titan were like, well, we just put a Kenny S there now. What are you going to do? And mm -hmm. he just kills everybody who keeps pushing A main. So now we have the pistol. Now is the time for redemption. Well, redemption. They have to, I know about redemption, but they have to go huge here. They have to win the pistol. They've no getting some that. ideas. Uh, of shooting his own teammate, I think. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Get out! He's uh, sick of assistance. We do have a quick push. They are going to go into the side here. Zemes picks up the first one. Uh, can he get the second? Yes, he can! Beautiful. Into the bomb site they go. RPK, though, perfectly positioned. And uh, still has to reload, but the actual bomb site is not A. It's going to be B. It's a lovely fake into uh, A, and I think LGB have sold them a perfect dummy here. Bomb planted. On site right now, Apex though somehow wins a, an impossible battle with a headshot. They're and quite RPK low now, follows one up. They are very low. In fact, both of them are very low, and both of them have. How did off. they do that? I have no idea how Titan were able to conjure up some magic, get into the bomb site, kill everyone, and get the bomb defused for a 12 4 lead. Magical! I don't believe it. I mean, Apex was just dueling pe like almost two or three guys at once at some points, and he. They just couldn't connect the shots. He's only down to 43, 43 health. I, I don't. I, uh, that's, that's I, honestly, disaster. though, Dan, like I know they won that, that. They had that round one. Uh, that's for sure. They did have that round one. And the weirdest thing is, it's 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 the old adage of right. They would do two three split. Right, we'll send one off to A as a distraction, and he gets the two entry kills whilst we're about to go into B. It's like the worst possible thing. Cause then you go, well, damn, we're on the wrong we're on the wrong bomb site. <laughs> immediately gets you into doubt. It, it immediately yeah. gets you to doubt. Indeed. Uh, and that's what they did, unfortunately. And they're twelve four down, and it's going to take a miracle of going for the plant massive yeah. proportions to get back. Let's see if they can get this quick plant here with the smokes that they've oh, set I up. I don't think so. Kenny S has other ideas and maniac as well. Ah, uh, yeah. And uh, that bomb is well and truly down. And yeah. Polly has a Glock in his hands. Good luck, my friend. No, no, and no. <laughs> no, no, denied. Ah, uh, no. Was that was the guy saying in the game? Ah uh, no. Uh, no 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 no. They have they Ah uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> You're pretty good at these. <laughs> uh, no, playing too no, no, much no, Counter Strike, no, obviously. No, no, That's no, what no, it no. is. Yeah. All right. You so play like little girls. Thirteen to four, and we have ourselves a match on our hands because LGB they got the AKs. I have the belief in the AKs here for LGB. They haven't you got have any nades. You do you? Well, Kenny is north as yeah. well, so it's gonna be hard. But they uh, are gonna walk into. Mid main there and just get completely gunned down. Existence wanted a peek. And no, 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 he wanted to give them some hope. Existence is now on the bench. He's out of this one.
Alright, so Mania going to go down as well. And they're going to make the move onto the A-bomb site. Apex, though, has certainly shown a high caliber of defensive play. And he's going to actually push in. That's the kind of work oh I was goodness. talking about. Oh my what goodness. a flash. Oh, Apex. That was absolutely superb. Love that. Had a little bit of a moment as well, didn't he, to himself. He was like, oh, shall I pick the first guy? Shall I pick the second guy? No, you know what? I'll do the first <laughs> guy. Had time to think about it. It was all in slow motion It for sounds him. like you described someone when they open a box of chocolates at Christmas time. It kind of was like that. It was a box of quality streets, frankly. And he was like, shall I take the cherry? Shall I take the caramel? Mm. I'll take the cherry. And, okay, I'll and I'll take the caramel. The, the thing there as well is that if we look at that round, LGB um, had an advantage. And Titan realized this. They're like, okay, we need to take a risk yep. to equalize or get ahead again. Because otherwise, we're going to let them have an advantage. And a, a better or our team that's good with an advantage should be us. So I there think, you go. I think James wants to point out that, that there's a man at the top of the scoreboard with 22 frags. Thanks, yeah. thanks James. And that man is... Uh, Dominating RPKs, it's absolutely on fire. He's had a fantastic game. Uh, Kenny S, pretty average. Uh, <laughs> what am I on about? Kid's ludicrous, and he knows it. Uh, if I if I have to play another Kenny S fake, by the way, in matchmaking ever again, oh my goodness, there are so many of them. Really? There should be like a league table in Steam. Oh, maybe. they kissed him. Oh, 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 oh! Finally got him in there. Nice. Well done, Ravinia. Uh, I'll come back to my point in a minute because this one's actually quite close. 3v2. Uh, although, uh, well, there's two very injured party on uh, the LGB side. But if they can get one kill here, I think they might just be able to force Titan away. And they can get one. Maniac's got himself down now. And the second one as well. Jake, a brilliant play from him. And LGB have a strand of hope at 514. So, yeah, getting back to my point, Vel should have like a weekly league table of most abused nickname in matchmaking. And I think Kenny S would probably come out on top. I, ran into well, I actually it. played three of them in the same game the other day. Three of them. Three? And they were called Kenny S in brackets one, <laughs> Kenny S in brackets two. That's hilarious. Yeah, and then a proper Kenny S. I'm like, come on, guys. Think about another. I'm sure it's the because original. they download the config, install it, and forget to change the name, right? I think it's fanboys. It's got to be. JW's the other one that has lots of, lots of fanboys mm. out there. Well, this, should, this round should be pretty easy clean up for LGB. In theory, you can see how how defensively Famous they're playing this. They, they, don't, they don't want to get rushed. They don't want to get wrecked on this round. They want to keep all the gun, guns alive. And the movement from Titan is all over the place here. They're trying uh, to get themselves yeah. into position. Yeah. But they've got no information. No. Apex no. has a, has a rifle. Where's Apex? He's... What do you on know? the, the, uh, the cattle fair. On cue. Look at that. Little boost over the top of red. Okay, so. Okay. This is going to be interesting right now because LGBT be are actually moving into this yep. as well. So. I can, I can already hear in your voice you're, you're ex anticipating I, the disaster. I, I am. The oh, I am. Catastrophe this is. This is like. Imminent. Oh, God. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> this is one of those rounds when you're a straight caller as well that you're going, guys, we're going to go in on 30. We're going to go on a 25. This is what they're going to do, right? And in your mind, you're going, I know exactly where they're going to be, but I'm going to play somewhere else anyway. Look, look oh, at that. Oh, We're perfectly frags. set up. Nicely done from Apex. The bomb site now is exposed a little bit here as Polly pops on top of red. As you go, oh, misses the first shot. That's unfortunate. Misses the second shot as well. Oh, <laughs> the knife through the smoke. Didn't quite come in on time. Polly somehow flicks round oh, and hilarious. gets the deagle shot, but RPK will finish things off. There wasn't enough time anyway. <laughs> awkward, awkward, awkward round. And Titan now have match point. They have 10 of them. That's so funny. You see like the guy running in the smoke with his arm just Awkward. like flashing there. <laughs> he's, like, he's like the guy out of Karate Kid. Wax on. <laughs> Wax off. I'm trying to get rid of that smoke with yeah. a knife. I'm trying to clear it. I'm trying to clean it up. I'm trying to polish it. Make it factory new. Doesn't work like that. Okay. Push into B now. Quick one from uh, OGB. But this, what is this? This is going to be GG. This is going to be absolutely GG. There's this no way round. they can storm in here. Look at this. Line them up. Oh, oh, PK. Four from RPK at the end of the game and 28 kills at the